Hello everyone, this is Jeffrey Antonio Diaz and you're watching the significance of old school technology. In this screencast, I'll teach you how to create batch file with the use of these operating system commands. By the way, let's talk about this operating system. This operating system refers to the character-based operating system commonly used on microcomputers. It is also a shorthand way of preparing to the command line interface. Nowadays, most of the young technologies doesn't have any idea in the flow or sequence behind graphical user interface. That's why this video would be a big help to those who are interested in command line interface. Batch file. It is a text file that contains a series of commands stored in order the user wants them carried out. It executes a series of commands with a minimum number of keystrokes. Batch files allows you to automate the process and at the same time create a more powerful commands which increases productivity. The most popular batch file is autoexec that but to create this file of commands, you write a text file using edit, copy con, or a text editor such as notepad. You can also use word processor providing that the operator system can execute. This file must have the file extension that bat and must be an ASCII file. Another file extension used in MT-based operating system is that CMD. In this activity, you will learn how to create batch file to automate sequence of commands. So before we start, let us enumerate the examples of those commands. CLS. It is also an example of internal DOS command used to clear the screen. To know more about CLS command, simply type CLS space slash question mark and then hit enter key. Copy. It is also an example of internal DOS command that copies one or more files to another location. For detailed instruction about copy command, just type copy space slash question mark and then press enter key. DIR. It is also an example of internal DOS command used to display place a list of files and subdirectories in a directory. For detailed instruction about DIR command, just type DIR space slash question mark and then press enter key. Echo. It is also an example of internal DOS command used to displace messages or turns command echoing on or off. To know more about echo command, simply type echo space slash question mark and then hit enter key. Pose. It is also an example of internal DOS command that suspends processing of a batch program and displays the message. To know more about post command, just type post space slash question mark and then press enter key. Prom. It is also an example of internal DOS command that changes the cmd.exe command prompt. For detailed instruction about prompt command, simply type prompt space slash question mark and then hit enter key. Pipe. It is an example of internal DOS command that displays the content of a text file or files. To know more about type command, simply type type space slash question mark and then hit enter key. Ver. It is an example of internal DOS command that displays the Windows version. For detailed instruction about ver command, just type ver space slash question mark and then press enter key. Edit. It is an example of external DOS command that starts MS-DOS editor which creates and changes ASCII text files. To know more about edit command, just type edit space slash question mark and then press enter key. Move. It is also an example of external DOS command that moves files and renames files and directories. For detailed instructions about move command, just type move space slash question mark and then press enter key. Note, to modify the program using edit, you need 32-bit operating system. But if you're using 64-bit operating system, you can modify the source code using notepad. Procedure on how to create a simple batch file. Type copy space call space file name dot bat and then press enter key. To save the batch program, end the program by pressing Ctrl plus Z on a new line and then hit enter key. To terminate the batch program, simply press Ctrl plus C. To test and launch the program, type file name dot bat and then press enter key. To save batch program to your USB flash drive, simply type copy space file name dot bat space volume drive letter of USB flash drive and then press enter key. So let's start creating our first batch file. We call this as welcome.bat. In this type of batch file, I intend to place the sign error. We will modify it later using external DOS command called edit. To start the program, simply type copy space con space welcome.bat and then press enter key. The ASCII code that we are about to use are ALT plus 176, ALT plus 
To launch the program, simply type welcome that button and then hit enter key. To view the source code of the file, simply type type space welcome that button and then press enter key. To modify the content of the program, simply type edit space welcome that button and then press enter key. Let us test the batch file again. Type welcome that button and then press enter key. So these are the factors that we are about to consider in transferring the files to USB flash drive. The first method is creating a simple backup by copying the files to USB flash drive. And the second one is moving the files to target location. Insert USB flash drive in USB port available in your computer. As you can see, the volume drive letter of USB flash drive is G colon. Again, don't forget the volume drive letter of USB flash drive which is G colon. Type explore space G colon and then press enter key. Let's see all the files and directories of desktop by typing dir and then press enter key. Let us copy welcome that bot from desktop to USB flash drive by typing copy space welcome that bot space G colon and then press enter key. Insert USB flash drive in USB port available in your computer. As you can see, the volume drive letter of USB flash drive is G colon. Let's see all the files and directories of desktop by typing dir and then press enter key. Let's transfer welcome that bot from desktop to USB flash drive by typing movie space welcome that bot space G colon and then press enter key. To check if welcome that bot moves successfully, just type explorer space G colon and then press enter key. Hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.